In episode 9 we have a jazz musician who has been diagnosed with ALS and he signs a DNR form and House believes that he's not diagnosed with ALS, he, he knows it's wrong and he breaks the law by resuscitating him. Already this episode is just one of those where you just watch with your mouth open, everything's just like, what are you doing? <laughs> It's like, you're gonna get in so much trouble! <laughs> you're like that person that's watching someone do something bad and you're just like, do I tell? Do I tell? Do I run away? Should I see this? It really did have me gripped and, you know, House does what he can legally to postpone the patient basically pulling the plug uh, just so he can prove that it isn't ALS and it like I said, it's just so gripping. You see him risk so much in this episode, his doctor's licence, he could go to prison all for the sake of solving the puzzle, for saving someone's life and the script is just really great here because you, you've got them talk about the messiah complex in the sense of, you know, someone wants to save the world whereas House has the Ru Rubik's complex, which is you must solve the puzzle. And I just, I loved that moment. That was just an excellent piece of writing. Episode nine was just a really touching episode. You know, House learns more about human interaction and it just sort of, as much as the episode is really tense, it just leaves you with that sort of warm, oh, feeling. <laughs>